Hey, this is James, and this is the ionic bonding for chemistry interactive notebooks. Now, with all my interactive notebooks, you'll see a sheet that looks like this, or pages that look like this, where it's one page per two students. You just print this out and cut down the middle, or you can have the students do it. Um, so this would be the notes sections where you, the notes section where you give students notes. I also build in some gradual release where the students practice. So for example, after you've taken some notes and you get to the practice section, it's an I do as a teacher. This is what you would do. The students take notes. Then it's a we do. So you can do this in various ways. You can have the students do it together and then help walk you through. I like to pretend that I forgot everything that I just said. So I have them talk me through it or I'll call on students to help me out. And then you do. So the students can do it individually or small groups to help them solve the problem. Um, and then I have a combination of just small graphic organizers that students can put in their interactive notebook. If you have any questions, please leave that in the comment section and I will do my best to get back with you. As always, thanks for watching. And if you haven't already done so, make sure to subscribe so that way you can bond with James. Thanks for watching.